your girlfriend's back and she's better than ever. watching it for Jessica James because that's my bad. Every day I stay high, say hi to my haters on my way up. <laughs> hey y'all, hey, welcome back to my channel. Y'all, it's my birthday. On this day, 33 years ago, a star was born. On this day, 33 years ago, a goddess popped out of a human. Do you get what I'm saying? On this day, 33 years ago, God gifted the greatest thing that's ever happened to my family. You know what I mean? Like on this day, 33 years ago, I want to spend today just reflecting, just reflecting on where I've been what I've accomplished this year, I tend to be so goal oriented that I can, I, I can forget where I came from and what I've done. I'm just really grateful. I'm really grateful for another year, God. Thank you for allowing me to see another year. Thank you for keeping me for another year. Thank you for protecting me for another year. Thank you for giving me the drive. Thank you for giving me the want, the desire to even want to do better, to appreciate each day of life because it really could be my last. Thank you for the reminders. Thank you for the synchronicities. Thank you for the nudges. Thank you for the deja vu. Thank you for all of it. I thought I knew what I wanted to. I thought I wanted to go to the trail. Maybe I will. I'm just tired. Because somebody went to bed after 6 a.m. and definitely woke up before 11 a.m. So here we are. Forgive me y'all if my energy is a little low. That four hours of sleep is catching up with me. I try not to really go in on energy drinks, but I did get a Celsius. I'm determined to work tonight. If I don't, it's not because I don't want to, but it definitely is my fault. I could have been more responsible last night. However, today's my day, so no regrets. So, this is what I got from Kroger's. I couldn't decide between the country. <laughs> I couldn't decide between the crunchy shrimp tempura roll or the Cajun seasoning. Like I like to get their pre-made shrimp. However, they don't really do the Cajun ones that often. And these are my favorite. So I had to get those. And I love to wrap my shrimp up in seaweed. It's a vibe. What else did I get? What else did I get? I think that was it. Other than that, I just got ice, ice in these drinks. When I tell y'all I am tired, I am tired. It's not even nighttime and I'm already driving like this, trying to stay awake. But when I went to work last night, that's also how I was. I was exhausted and it was raining. So the roads just looked like a jigsaw puzzle at some points, but she persevered and she made some shmoney and we love that for her. But let's eat. Yay. When I thought about what I wanted to eat and what I wanted to do, there's nothing, there's nothing extravagant like that I wanted. I genuinely wanted public chicken tenders. I just didn't feel like fighting Publix. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. On to the shrimp. The song that's playing in my head right now is Secret Place by Commission, specifically the reunion version live. And Commission is the group that Fred Hammond was a part of once upon a time. But if you want a good worship song, Secret Place by Commission, Yes by Shekinah Glory, anything Juanita Bynum, uh, Behind the Veil, that whole album. 
And I really been into that Yeshua song. Yeshua. Uh, They really put crack in that song. I'm not gonna lie. This could use some Obey, which I do have. I just don't don't feel like fighting the pantry today. So I'm finding any reason to the time. Guess I gotta get some hell of fun. Look at everything just coming back to life. Mm. I feel so good. I am grateful to be alive. I am grateful to be grateful. I have really been in a headspace for the past two months. But I really feel like myself right now. Like, I really feel like I'm back. And not even that I'm back, I'm better. You know what I mean? I don't even have the words. Like, I be having so much to say, but the minute I turn this camera on, it's just like, it's gone. You can tell from the fit that I am so unserious about this hike. I really just came out here to vibe. I came out here to catch a vibe, catch a vibe. I came out here to catch a vibe, catch a vibe. And I really wanted to be alone, which is why I came up here. I feel like this little watering hole has been discovered because parking, the fa past few times I've come, have been, ugh. And there are literally only about maybe, maybe 10 parking spots. Like it really, it's a little nook and cranny. Dang. I bought me a Bev. Today we're going with the Sweetwater Hazy IPA. Get the music going. If I love the way I let it take me.
My sister and I are about to go get something to eat real quick. Um, I forgot it's Sunday and that place is closed early, so I gotta get all the lights now that my um my lights are out. I'm so sad about it. But that's alright. Do I want a vibey light? I can't yet tell if that looks good or bad, but it's what I'm doing. Spicy cold noodles, I forgot, raw marinated crab, rice, cream, shrimp, and I don't remember. Thank you so much, sis. This is um, 
was amazing. Mm-hmm. Top meal I've had in my 10 year in Atlanta. I am full. I am satisfied. That was so good. That was so good. That was so good. That was so good. And I have wanted to try spicy raw marinated crab for the longest, but everywhere doesn't sell it. So I was really shocked when I saw that and immediately yes, I had to try it. It is a very rainy day, and it's supposed to be raining all day today, which is fine with me. This is some of my favorite weather. <sighs> rainy days are movie days, and there's no, no ifs, ands, or buts about it. Rainy days are movie days. So that's what I'm setting myself up for. I just need to go to the store. I'm gonna go to Publix. I have been craving Publix all week and have yet to go. If the sub line isn't too long, I definitely wanna get a sub. But if it is too long, I'm gonna get the chicken tenders. If I get the sub, I'm gonna get the chicken tenders anyways for later. So I'm just hoping that I can get the sub. I kid you not, I kid you not. You could get in that line and you could be customer number four in that line and you are still gonna be in there for an hour. So I'll crave Publix, but if I'm on this side of town, I typically don't get it because parking, lines, lines, lines. You know what, let me switch up my energy on that. God, I am so grateful that there is a Publix in my vicinity. I may lack a little patience, to get what I want in this Publix, but I do have the opportunity to go. I have the means to go. I have the vehicle to get me there. I am grateful, God. I wanna stop complaining. Every time I feel myself complaining, I really wanna swap it out for gratitude. Even, I don't care if it's the most minuscule thing. I wanna get that out my aura. I wanna get that out my energy. Ha, ha, love. Yeah, let's just see where the day goes, cause guess what? I can do anything I want. We start thinking we really don't have choices and options in this piece. You feel me? I don't know. I actually ain't even gonna go there. Like, people will argue you down for bondage. <laughs> and I'm gonna let them have it every time. You get it, you get it, you don't, you don't. The girls that get it, get it. <sighs> let <sighs> Let's go to Publix. Let's go to Publix. Come on, son. Where are you, Christmas? You got to show me love. In and out, in and out, in and out, in and out, in and out. I need something with pockets. I'm gonna pockets. So that took the entire hour. 
it took the whole hour that I thought it would, which is fine because I knew it would. They switched up so much stuff. They coming up, they making it a suburban Publix and I love that. They have self checkout now. They have the sushi and they changed up the, the sub line. They are coming up, like they coming up and they switched so much stuff around. I don't know. I'm just, I'm happy for them or whatever. Life's better on Saturn. We're on the Does anybody know a scissor song from start to finish? Like, can you mumble everything correctly? Or do we all just be out here making up what we think it sound like? Mm. I got my sister's sub when I was in there. I'm gonna leave mine in here. So I'm gonna run in and go give her her sub and then we're gonna get started. Your girlfriend's back and she's better than ever. I actually was gonna take a little fun guy and do a little trippy trip, but I personally prefer to do them on an empty stomach, but I would've did that. I would've started earlier if that was the case because now I'm hungry and I'm prioritizing food. That's what I want and that's what I'm gonna do. We are gonna do a little movie or whatever. Um, bringing out the laptop. I really don't use my laptop for much of anything just because of its age and how he has been acting lately. But just for y'all, just for y'all, I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. Also, another reason is strictly because it's at that point of its life where it needs to kind of sit on the charger to live. And I have the Jackery 300 and you're not about to kill my battery. But yeah, y'all, sis is gonna catch a vibe. I have my favorite bed for the web, so I don't know. I'm excited. The vibes are about to be very chill and very immaculate, and I'm here for that. Actually, let me drink me some more kombucha. Let's see what we want to watch. Oh, you know what? What I'm supposed to be doing is starting my vibe. You feel me? Oh my god! Uh. Uh. <coughs> yeah, you just you <coughs> blow on me. Just blow on me. Can I be screwed? All right, so I found the movie. I found this quick too. I'm really proud of that. Today's beverage is Captain Dynamite IPA by Voodoo Ranger. Oh, you know what? Let me connect my speaker. I am almost ready to enjoy the sub. Really, I'm watching it for Jessica James. I love her. I like this song. I forgot to put salt and pepper, oregano. Actually, I have all of those. I'm gonna do that. Turkey sub. So. Sure. This is going to be perfect. Mm -hmm. 
cranberry. Welcome to Glass Key. Ah! I don't even know. I don't even know. Nice <sighs> I'm plugging it in. I'm plugging it in. I'm not gonna stress a thing today. I'm really, really not. I hope I don't have to throw this away, but if I do, it's fine. Opportunity for something new. I'm just gonna leave that be for now. Most unnecessary spill. Start out and decide about by caring about. If there are things that you want that aren't flowing easily, then there is a reason for it, for sure. Uh, belief is just a thought you keep thinking, and if you don't feel mostly really good most of the time, then there is a reason for it. Hey y'all, hey. Honestly, everything pretty much just fell apart after I spilled that Greek yogurt. Like, my laptop died, and from there, it was never the same again. Like, I, it took forever to come back on, and then the internet stopped working. I just, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what happened. But, we did. <laughs> And I was so cold last night. So let me show y'all. So in this bag here, we have my comforter and we have my rug. So I called myself trying to do laundry last night and I don't know what happened. I followed the same procedure I literally always do. So I went to put that in the washer and then went to go take my shower. While I'm in the shower, my nephew comes and he's like, Auntie, the garage is flooded. And I was just like, what, what do you mean? And sure enough, I get my clothes on and I go downstairs and the garage is flooded. So I transferred my clothes to the bag, soaking wet, everything up there is soaking, soaking wet. And I'm gonna just take it to a um, laundromat, probably not even today, honestly. That's how much I don't care. Like I'm just, I don't care. I don't care, I don't care, I don't care. I'll take it to a laundromat when I take it. But actually, mm, I was really cold tonight. I was, well, last night. One blanket alone is just not enough. About four o'clock in the morning, I got up and got dressed. <laughs> like, this ain't, this ain't, this ain't it. And that's actually part of the reason I don't like using people's stuff anyways. I have just prefer to do my stuff on my own. Because if something go wrong, it's your fault because you was using it. And again, I can get that, I can respect that. I understand being upset, but the attitude, <laughs> This has been a good Abraham Hicks filled morning. I have thoroughly enjoyed it. I'm in the mood for Janae's tiny desk. I'm so elevated. Thank God that we made it. Manifested all my dreams. Every day I stay high. Say hi to my haters on my way up.
like I don't, but I know what I want. What's up? Ain't got nothing to do with that washing machine. That's that toilet. Which toilet? There's a whole bunch of shit that came up. Like poop? Like literal shit? Y'all yeah. done spilled something else? At this point, I don't know. I don't know what else to do. I gotta find some organizational situation for these cup holders because I need those free. I need those free because I cannot be trusted. And that's all right. I know this about me. It's a little worse, a little worse than I expected, but you know, we'll get it together. Oh, I've been kind of using Rupert as a chew toy. Chewing him with your crotch? Our friend, you're going to jail. Don't come behind us. My dad told me he's- Speed of the night. I heard, did you watch Friday Night Lights? This Brandon. The best way to disarm a bully is to befriend him. Just throw him in the, him in the tree. Learning. Here, what He's the safe. hell? What? Well, she must really be PBSing, right? What? I mean, it's like pop a couple of tampons, you know? Stewie, do you even know what a menstrual cycle is? Uh, yeah, Brian. <laughs> a good way to get around town, that's what it is. <laughs> so we're gonna go to the Chinese buffet I'm gonna edit tonight and see if I could find a maybe a 24-hour uh, laundromat so that I could go ahead and rewash and drive my uh, comforter and rug so we'll see I'm not pressed but I might be slightly panini pressed because I woke up so cold I was freezing this morning and it's gonna be 40. It's a low of the 40s tonight. So either I'm gonna thug it or I'm gonna find something. I don't know. Either way, it's my decision. <laughs> I am back in the van. I am parked and I'm about to watch a movie and go to bed. I'm gonna watch that Roadhouse movie that I tried to watch the other night. Oh my God. So when we got to the buffet, I don't even know what made me move the bag with my wet blanket in it. I don't even know what made me move it. But when I did, there was a puddle, a literal puddle on my floor. And I spazzed. I spazzed a little bit because I am so over it. But then I regrounded and now she's back. I'm going to watch that movie, go to bed, get up in the morning and take that stuff to a laundromat and get it cleaned and dried. And while I'm at the laundromat, I'm going to go ahead and start editing. I don't know how long this vlog is going to be, to be quite honest. I think it might be up there, y'all. I think it might be up there. My birthday was the 23rd, it is the 28th. And I feel like I filmed a little bit each of those days, maybe with the exclusion of a day or two. So yeah, I'm not looking forward to it, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna start editing. I'm gonna go through everything and get everything together. I already know that I forgot to do a thumbnail, <laughs> but we live to learn another day. But go ahead and like this video if you like this video. Comment if you got something to say and subscribe if you like the vibe.